Good morning, morning Eagles. Eagles. I'm Faith. And I'm Jordan. And, and these are your morning announcements. Morning. FCCLA will meet this Thursday, November 2nd in room 117, Ms. Kofer, from 3.45 to 4.30 p.m. Please bring your signed application and $15 fee. Be inspired. Debate team meeting has been moved to Thursday in FTA room 609, 3.35 p.m. Freshman, sophomore, junior, and senior classes, student organization, staff, and Eagle Nation. FBLA's canned food drive has been extended until Wednesday, November 8th. Please donate a can or two that will benefit a family in need. All donations will be will be received by Cobb County families. Canned goods can be delivered to room A203 or the front office. All students interested in becoming a basketball manager, please pick up an application from Coach Mulcher or Coach Kelly. More student and faculty volunteers are still needed for the Big Greenhouse Cleanup Project next Saturday, November 4th from 9 to 1 p.m. Individual students, faculty, class groups, or clubs and organizations need to join the efforts to clean up our greenhouse and get some plants and vegetables growing in there by spring. A sign-up sheet is being distributed to all class groups and student organizations, and you can double community service hours for participants in the effort. See Ms. Berrigan, Mr. Pacheco, or Mr. Bird in the FTA building for more info and to sign up. If you guys seen any of our Eagle TV members wandering around the school recording, it was all preparation for the upcoming film festival. We are now happy to share with you guys the winning video for this year's Prep Film Festival. Oh my god. Oh, well, what's up? Oh, so I was just getting some cameras for this project. Chastain wants us to go to construction so we can film another project. Alright. Alright, so basically just go ahead and go up to construction and I'll meet you there. I gotta grab some more equipment. Yeah, Alright, got it. Alright. Jeremy! Oh, it was just a prank. Calm down. It was just a prank. What's that? I was actually trying to buy something. Cool. Alright, chill, chill. It's a joke. Alright, you want to go record the construction? Yeah, let's go. You got the camera? Mm -hmm. Alright. Isn't Juan supposed to be here already? I thought he was with you. No. He wasn't with me? Well, I don't know where he's at. Man, it's your fault that we have to refilm this, bro. My fault? Yeah. If you're so smart, why don't you do it? Man, alright. You stay here and I'll get my shots. Alright, hurry up.
Okay, Robert Bird here. I'm inside South Cobb's greenhouse. Look at this place. Just look at it. It's a mess. Man, look at this. It's a mess. Weeds all over the place. The back wall down. You got water leaks in here. You got pipes that are messed up. Ah, oh, this place is a mess. It's an embarrassment to us as the South Cobb Eagle Nation. It's an embarrassment. Glad nobody comes in here. Glad nobody comes in here. Okay, but we can get this right. We can get this right, both inside and out. A complete mess. Racks down on the floors, uh, unorganized, uh, pipes busted, water dripping, leaves all over the place outside. Dead plants as well as growing plants all in here, okay? We can do better than this. This is not representative of us. It's not. It's not representative of us, the Eagle Nation. We're going to do better than this. We must do better than this. We can make this a place that's a shining star for South Cobb High School and for the entire Eagle Nation. All it takes is a little bit of work, a little bit of work by all of us, starting with me, the students, the faculty, the staff, the organizations, the classes. We can get this right and make this, make this something that we all can be proud of, OK? We're going to start on that on Saturday, November the 4th, 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. I don't care if you come for a half hour, an hour, four hours. I don't care if you stay five or six hours. Just need you to come out and help us get it done. We've started to gather some tools and equipment. All we need is people now, people to show up and help us get this done. Clean all this out so that we can start planting this fall, okay, and grow plants over the winter, okay, that will allow us to plant them around the campus and out in the community, sell them, okay? All right? And this will be much better, be much better for all of us. So I need students, faculty, I need student organizations, I need the members of the classes, freshmen, sophomore, junior, senior class. Here's a way to leave a legacy. Here's a way to make a mark here on South Cobb campus. This will be here if you help us come out and get it started, okay? Remember, if you come out that day, it's community service hours, double community service hours for everybody who comes out and spends whatever amount of time needs to be spent. We got work to do both inside here and outside and then in a couple of other places around the campus. Come on, join me. Don't make excuses. Come on. Be here Saturday, October the, November, excuse me, Saturday, November the 4th, 9 a.m., 1 p.m. Meet us right here at the Greenhouse. Eagle Nation, let's get this done. My name is Faith, and I'm here with Stefan, Helene, Tajane. And today we're going to ask you guys a few questions about Day of the Dead. So, what is exactly Day of the Dead? Uh, it's basically um, it's celebrated in uh, Mexico primarily, but other places in the world like Bolivia, Ecuador, and etc. But um, it's mainly about um, remembering those who have passed away and celebrating their life and bringing offerings to remembering them. So, what does it symbolize? Um, it just brings, it symbolizes spirits coming back to life and rejoicing on the days of October 31st to November 2nd, where the souls of the deceased can come back and reunite with family. And yeah. <laughs> and who did you choose to recognize? I chose to do Selena because she's just amazing and I had to give her a recognition. <laughs> you heard it here first, Eagles.
That's all for today's announcements. Have, Have a, a great, great day, Eagles. Eagles.